Hello ladies and welcome back to a new video. I'm Yvrenia and this is the channel for femininity, self-improvement, elegance and where we help you to become the best version of yourself. Today's video is all about signs that the man that you're dating or even in a relationship with is not that into you. Ladies, I would say let's get straight into today's video. Dating and relationships are very important topics to talk about as women because it helps us to recognize people's behavior, it's about psychology, and very importantly, it's about educating ourselves so that we can protect ourselves and don't put ourselves in situations that we don't want to be in. You only have to open your social media and you literally will see women being disrespected and being humiliated online. And it really breaks my heart to see that. I think with the right education, with the right knowledge, but also a lot of self-work, right? Because a lot of have to do has to do with self-love and self-respect. A lot of those things can be prevented. And that's why I think that the topic of dating and relationships is a very important topic to talk about. And today's video is about signs that a man is not into you. How can you recognize that? Let's start with point number one. Number one, you're always the first one making plans. This is also known as chasing something that we have talked about on the channel and chasing is about you always calling him first texting him first and constantly making plans to do something nice together and he doesn't mind coming if he doesn't have anything better to do but he's never the one that comes up with nice date ideas or comes up with something fun that the two of you can do he does not pursue you you are pursuing him and remember that especially in the beginning of the relationship, the man needs to pursue you. He needs to want to win you over, right? If there's none of that in the beginning of the relationship, he is not into you. And the affirmation that I love to use when it comes to attracting is, I don't chase, I attract. Repeat that to yourself. You don't chase, you attract. Sign number two. He doesn't ask you about your life. If he doesn't really seem interested in your life, in your career, your hobbies, or the things that you have been up to, that is a sign that he's not really interested in getting to know you. Because when a man is truly interested in getting to know you, he will make an effort to get to know more about you. He's going to ask you more personal questions and not just the superficial questions about the weather, right? He wants to know what you are about, what you think and what you feel. And you can just feel when someone is really, truly interested in getting to know you. Number three, he breadcrumbs you. Breadcrumbing is when a person is not really into you, but they still want to have you around for moments that they need company. Examples of breadcrumbing are when he is texting you to see how you're doing without the intention of meeting up or planning something nice, but it's with the intention of being on your mind. Another example is when he's watching your Instagram stories or he's liking your post, just to make sure that he is still on your mind without minimum effort on his part and without actually properly getting in touch with you, but you're still thinking about him. Ladies, now I would love to hear from you. Have you been in a situation where a man showed you signs that he was not interested in you? Please share it with us in the comment section below. Well, I will go first. And I have definitely been in situations like that. And for me, it was definitely the person not trying to get to know me personally, but keeping it very superficial, even too superficial. And I do think it's important to get to know the person that's in front of you and talk about something different than just the weather. Number four, your relationship is mostly physical. If the only activity that the two of you do is Netflix and chill, at his place or your place, and you never really see each other when sex is not involved, well, then he's not into you as a person. He is into what he can get from you sexually. And you're so much more than what you can offer someone sexually. Don't confuse lust for love. Any man can actually lust after you, but not every man can be genuinely interested in you and can love you. Sign number five, he is hot and cold. I think the very first thing coming to mind is the Katy Perry song, Hot and Cold. 
And the meaning of acting hot and cold is that when you are in a hot phase, you feel the attention and attraction and you feel wanted. But when you are in a cold phase, the man pulls away, making you crave his attention and affection. And this results into feeling rejected, confused, frustrated, and unwanted. One moment he's completely into you and all over you, and the next moment he's not. When a man is repeatedly picking you up and just dropping you whenever he feels like it, that's a sign that he's not into you. Sign number six, he takes a very long time to call you back or to text you back. I have to start this point by saying that we are not on our phone 24 seven. We all have things to do and responsibilities throughout the day. And personally, I am not a fast texter myself. However, that doesn't make it okay for him to not text you back or call you back until days after. If you are important to him, he can find those five minutes in the day to call you back or to text you back. And if he takes days to text you back and he's very inconsistent when it comes to communication, it means that you are not a priority to him. Because think about it. We make time for the things that are important to us, even if it's just five minutes. And ladies, now it's time for a quote. You will never be good enough for the wrong person. Number seven, he keeps you a secret from his friends and family. Being introduced to each other's friends and especially each other's family is a very important step in any new relationship. It will take a couple of weeks or even some months before a person feels ready to do this. It often takes longer when it comes to family, but when it comes to friends, it should come much easier, especially when you have already introduced him to your friends. So if the man that you have been seeing keeps finding excuses to introduce you to his friends, that is a sign that he doesn't really want you to become part of his life and he's probably not into you. Number eight, he is unreliable. When a man shows you that he's not valuing and respecting your time, he also shows you that he's not serious about you. Number nine, he shows negative or closed body language. Actions really speak louder than words. And that's why body language is so important. Someone can tell you that they are really interested in you, but what is their body language telling you? Examples of negative and closed body language are crossed arms, constantly looking at their watch or the clock or their phone, looking bored, not being present, fake smiles, lack of eye contact, and the tone of voice is very important. Is it soft and warm or is it impatient and, and not warm at all. These are just a couple of signs of negative body language. And what this is showing is disinterest. Definitely keep your eyes open for these. Number 10, he tells you he is not looking for a relationship. This is when he indirectly tells you that he's not into you by saying that he's not looking for a relationship. When he says anything like he's not ready for a relationship, he's not into relationships, or he's not good at relationships, take that as a sign that he is not into you. And ladies, those were the 10 signs that a man is not into you. And of course there are more signs, so definitely share them with us in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video, definitely give the video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, have an amazing week, and we will see each other in next week's video. Bye ladies.